Hello, hello, this is Jaron Lanier, and this is a video to explain some music I made called Symphony for Moogfest. I'm keynoting the Moogfest this year, and I'm thrilled to be doing it. And uh, so long ago, I used to build modular synthesizers as a kid, uh, and I thought I'd make some new music um, using my current modular synthesizer, which is back here blinking, and I call it the Potala after the uh, Tibetan palace in Lhasa, because it looks a little like it. So there's four movements to the symphony, and in each one of them, the Potala is playing a kind of rhythm that is not typical of our era. These days we have like all these steady beats, bum, 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 bum. And I like rhythms that are more like heartbeats or the surf or the seasons where there's an equilibrium and a system that's always bringing it back to that equilibrium, but it's not a perfect repetition. So you'll hear that there's no repetition. I, I set up patches where the rhythm is building in one direction and it's pulled back to the other direction and you get this um, semi-repetition, which I find a lot more interesting. In the first three movements, I'm recording live with a stereo mic in the room, and I'm playing an acoustic instrument, but a different one each time that's processed through the synthesizer as well as being heard live by the stereo mic. Um, in the first one, uh, it's a clarinet, and I have a little uh, barrel pickup on the clarinet. And in the second one, it's an oud, which is one of these. Also with a pickup, and then there's a penny whistle, and then the last one I actually overdub. So I started off playing um, a fiddle. It's actually this uh, Hardanger fiddle from uh, the Norwegian fiddle with sympathetic strings. And then I overdubbed a piano um, and a little bit of serpent, which is <laughs> this wonderful, crazy bass instrument that used to be the best bass brass instrument until people figured out how to make better ones and I kind of love it even though it's crazy and I'm, I'm working on another piece with it um, and uh, there's a piano on the last one too and for piano geeks it's a special one it's a 1929 Mason and Hamlin double C so for those of you in the know that's what that's that's a cool piano um, I hope you enjoy the music um, as you'll hear it combines this kind of uh, non, not quite periodic beat with explorations of scales that are kind of like in the Ragor Makam concept of music where you're sliding around finding different intervals. Um, and uh, what else can I tell you? Yes, it's a HoloLens. They're fun. I hope you like those. Uh, okay, great. I'll see you in North Carolina. And um, well, I'll be very, 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 very careful to use the right bathrooms, right? It's very important one of the biggest problems in the world. Okay, see you guys soon.